Hello guys and welcome to episode 3 of the the lesser season. My name is Leon Gamer and I just recorded the game against Man City and guess what? It didn't record. It only recorded the last 30 seconds <laughs> of us losing which is pretty devastating because it was a decent one. We've done not too bad. But anyway, I'll just record the next game anyway and um, let you know what we've been up to. I went through everything. I went, I went through a lot of stuff in that episode. I'm, I'm, pretty, I'm pretty gutted about that. Um, <laughs> it's always typical. But anyway, I found out how to spell Leonardo's first name, and it's Ujoha, apparently. So um, we'll try and remember that, and also Alex Schalke as well, I believe his name, or Alex Schalk, or Schalk. We've been told to scout. Let's have a look at him. There he is. Once it loads. He's actually a pretty decent player, in all honesty. Uh, I've gave him a wee scout. He's rated three and a half star. Not so bad, but we'll find out how to get on it. So we're going to just go and holiday to the next game. We did lose against Man City there. Normally, that this this should have been the episode that was going to get recorded and all the rest of it. Um, but it just wasn't to be. I don't think I've pressed record. And then when I didn't press record, I pressed it in the last 30 seconds. So, yeah, go me. <laughs> uh, but yeah, if you haven't already checked out, check out the LSC Marshall update on Facebook and FM base. Uh, if you want to have a wee check out that. Um, it's pretty good, man. It really does um, spark up the interest, even for well, for likes of myself, I tend to lose interest in FM pretty quickly after the after the season's ended, pretty much. So it's always good to start something new, and hopefully things go pretty well, especially with new players and all the rest of it. So at the moment we're doing pretty damn crap, Leonardo. I'm going to play you because I profess it's been poor, and um, yeah, we're going to just jump straight into this game. This is going to be against Tottenham. Tottenham are having a pretty devastating season. And um, in this moment in time, I might move up, um, drink more. I'll, I'll wait and see. I'll wait and see. Right. So yeah, I'm, it's currently like half past 11 at night just now. and I've pretty much just woken up. I've been out all day. Um, been away out at what we call the, the Highland Games. Um, obviously being on the island where I stayed Isle of Butte, it was the, the Butte Highland Games this, was, uh, this this weekend. So I had a few bit a few, a few drinks, came back, I've had to go for a sleep, and I've just woken up and thought I'd do some recording. <laughs> um don't think I'm I'm as, as drunk as I was earlier on, but it's all good. So Andy King early on gets it to Knockart, plays inside to Ujoha, down to Knockart, Knockart's gonna get a shot, but it's past the goalkeeper at the right hand side. Not in the back of the net, unfortunately. Right, come on. Come on, guys. Todd Kane has taken a knock, but should be able to shake it off. Of course you will. Todd Kane down to Leonardo. Knockart back down. Todd Kane is going to... Oh, go on. Todd Kane, get in the box. Pass it back. Oh, Hugo Lloris picks up the loose ball. Tottenham have a find it pretty difficult to get anything against us here at the moment. Touch wood. I say that now, but they'll probably go and score. Uh, intercepted by Todd Kane, who's starting to kind of push on now and have a pretty decent season for us. Lamela with the show, with a terrible shot, in all honesty. That was poor. <laughs> As things stand, we're only we're just cut to half an hour into the game. Leonardo is going to get the ball through to Andy King. Andy King going to run at the box. Oh, it's a way Dembele manages to get away from the, the clutches of McKay Stevens. Damn it. We're doing not too bad here, guys. Hopefully we can pick up a result. We really need to start picking up some wins every now and then. Hugh Loris gets it down to to blind. It's going to be headed down by Dembele. Dembele is going to put it through Soldado to Chadley. Chadley gets a shot, but it's just hit the, the side net and not so bad, not so bad. As things stand, we're actually doing not too bad here. For a couple of decent chances. Knockhart's been poor, so we're going to bring on Mark Albrighton for him. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. But I know um, Knockhart being one of the better Leicester players, you guys absolutely love him. I'm not surprised, he's a he's a really good player. So Mark Albrighton's just lost out to Vertonghen. So Dado to Eriksson, Eriksson to Lamela, who's going to make a run at the defence, number 11. Good save by, I almost said Peter Schmeichel, but it's surely not. Uh, Vertonghen with the corner, it's going to whip it in, and it's away by 
Oh, Dembele's got it again. Good save by Schmeichel. As things stand, 55 minutes gone at the moment. There's really not a lot happening. Todd Kane has taken a few knocks already. We're going to make a substitution. Bring on Abu Dhabi for Nick Pill. And we're going to bring on Robert Akrafresca for Ujoha. I'm definitely not saying that right. I can't be his name. It doesn't, it doesn't spell his name. Come on. <laughs> so Andy King down to drink water. He's going to lose it out to Lamela. Adabayor. Nice ball out to Eriksson down the left hand side. Lovely ball into the box and Schmeichel just grabs the loose cross. Thank God. Schmeichel kicks it out. The Abbey headed down to Akrafresca. Andy King going to get it back to drink water. Some good football here. Akrafresca. Oh, has just been annihilated there. He is down. Not out. He's down but not out. Oh, come on. It's a penalty. That has to be a penalty. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, that was that was interesting. We were 66 minutes gone, Akrafeska has just been levelled. And f <laughs> come on. We've made all substitutions. This is crazy. This is so unfair. Right, okay. We're going to move McKay Stevens and O'Brien up to far wide. That's really, we can't do anything else. <laughs> it sucks so much. Right, okay. Akrafeska just got annihilated in midfield, left in a heap on the floor. And uh, we're down to 10 men because of it now, which is fantastic. So it looks like he's going to be out for some time. And we're going to, just, we're going to hold this out for a draw, it looks like it. Lamela gets it back. We've managed to pick up a one all draw here, um, which is actually pretty decent in all honesty. Considering we went down to 10 men, of no fault of our own. We were unlucky today make the lads know that. And we've stayed in 14th position. I think the the magic number is going to be 35 points. That's what we need to try and get this season. So if we can get 35 points, we should be safe. The ball does, we'll just have a wee quick check at the, the other games we have played. I'll let you see the results, the goals, etc. And um, let you know what I'm doing tactic-wise now. I also went and changed a lot of the staff members as well. I've got a lot of new staff at the club to try and help. And I'll just show you the the training coaches, everything is more than, or three and a half star or more, which is great, fantastic. Uh, but we'll have a quick check at the previous results, and after the QPR game, which was the, the last recording, which should have been the Man City one, um, we did go and play Chelsea, and we got beat 3-2. So Liam Moore picking up the first goal of the game for us in the 69th minute. Let's check that and see how he got on here. It was knock up with the ball, and Liam Moore at the near post gets the goal. And Knockhart with the, the second of the game. It's to Romero and it's just played nicely back into Knockhart who puts it in at the goalkeeper and the keeper just can't really do much about it. So that was the uh, that result. We then beat West Brom 1-0. Uh, Anthony Knockhart getting himself in the score sheet again. He's actually coming on quite a bit and this was the only shot of the game on target for their, our team. So, But look at that for a free kick in the top corner. Pick it out. The next one we had a 4-1 loss to Aston Villa which was pretty devastating and it was the uh, Johar Leonardo with the, the only goal for us in the 50th minute and uh, this this made it 2-1 for us I thought we might even come back in but then they just piled on the pressure but McKay Steven back to Nick Pell saved by Guzan but just drops down for Leonardo and it's in the back of the net for 4-1 which wasn't good but we picked up a 0-0 a result there against Tottenham which was pretty decent for us um, the next game we will be back for is going to be the West Ham game, away from home, so that should be interesting. How are they get on this season? They're having a pretty decent season. And at the moment, as things stand, we are just in between Crystal Palace and Tottenham. So if we can pick up a, a one or two, it should fire us up the table pretty nicely. I hope you've all enjoyed, guys. Please like and subscribe. I'm, quite, I'm really happy with how the how the first episode of the channel has been, been taken. There's been a lot of sub new subscribers, there's been over 300 views on it which is fantastic and I'll continue to get as much views as possible. Um, for people who don't realise as well, if you get likes and subscribes, it, the more likes you get and comments and subscribes, I don't think subscribers really matter as much, but it's more comments and likes, the more you have of that, the higher you go up in the search rating. So when people search for something, for example, uh, a Leicester Football Manager season, um, they'll find all the ones that have got higher kind of likes and comments first and that's how people get noticed so you guys do your thing it'd be fantastic to, to see the support given and uh, i'll catch you on the next episode i've been nylon gamer and i'll catch you all next time bye bye